we uh, we do groundwater surveys in a, in a lot of different kinds of areas. This is an area where we have a situation where the property line is, is very near to uh, the line uh, that's formed by these woods. And so um, we, uh, we actually, in a prior uh, survey, ran um, a line straight into the woods. And now, today, we're coming across perpendicular uh, to that line. And we're going to run two surveys back into these woods, uh, running parallel, approximately parallel, to a creek. It's nice and cool back in the woods. Here you can see the line, the old line that we ran with the red flags. These uh, spacings are anywhere from 10 to 20 feet, depending upon the resolution and the depth of uh, survey that we want to achieve. And there you see the cables um, for the survey that we're running at this very moment. And there you can see our equipment that's set up, that's taken readings now. Um, and um, this is what we call a 56 electrode line. And an electrode looks like that, and it's attached to a stainless steel stake. These particular stakes are, are long stakes that we're using. Um, soil in here is a little loose, and so we want to make sure that we get good uh, conductivity readings. Here's our equipment that we use. This is advanced geophysics um, hardware and, and software from a company in Austin, Texas. and They've been very good to us through the years and we appreciate our relationship with them. This has been an incredible piece of equipment that's lasted for us for many years. It's very robust and um, right now it's um, taking uh, readings and sending out um, pulses of electricity and um, measuring uh, the resistivity that it encounters as it moves through the subsoil and through the um, bedrock geology of this area.